Hey everybody. Um, I recently picked up a uh, flash cowl for my 2013 Jeep and uh, I've been messing around with it a little bit. I noticed there's an incredible amount of frustration online about the tire pressure monitoring system uh, disabling feature that would be uh, available through a download off of Spark uh, through Flash Cal's website. So when I first bought this thing, what I did is I uh, did the update and everything went smoothly. It took me several times to get it to work properly, but I finally managed to get it done and I also managed to upload the tire pressure monitor system data uh, for off-road use and had it on here. So the other day I plugged this thing in to my Jeep and it looks like it's doing uh, it's doing fine. It hooks everything up and I do see the option on there for an off-road uh, uh, adjustment. However, let me turn, let me put the key of the ignition here and turn it on so I can talk along with you here. However, I, uh, I look on it today, which is a few days later, and I'm sitting there going, well, I don't see it on there anymore. So it's almost like it had vanished. Um, so I'm going to make this uh, video to kind of show you what's going on with it and uh, see if there's a way that I can resolve it and post this up for everybody to see. Because it, uh, I have not found a single video on YouTube concerning this, and I know that a lot of people would probably be very interested to find out what uh, what they can do about it. So as you can see, it uh, retrieved TPMS data, or so it says, which I believe is whatever it, uh, that I uploaded in here. And now I've got these options, tire size, axle ratio, transfer case high, trans uh, case low, lamp delay, running lights, uh, accessory delay, lane change, lamp flash, horn chirp, engine idle, axle lock enable, fog lights with highs, and then return to stock. But as you can see, there is no feature on here to turn off the tire pressure monitoring system or otherwise adjusted which from what I understand is not even available in the newer update anyways so um, I'm going to hook this thing back up to the computer do another update and see what I can find out all right so what I did is I got back on the scar a spark and I uh, decided to uh, try this again Let's see if there's any change. I updated everything and I had to, I re-downloaded and reinstalled the uh, tire pressure monitor disable. And let's see if it does anything this time. It almost seems like every time you go to download it, or any time you, and there's retrieving TPMS data again. Tire size, axle ratio, lamp delay, TPMS off-road, and there it is, it's back on. So if I select that, we will turn it on. This will disable your TPMS. So I just disabled TPMS. Looks like that's the way you have to do it. So to summarize, what I had to end up doing is when I first got the flash cowl, I downloaded everything. I put it on, uh, I, I put the TPMS off-road on there, and then I came in, tried to hook up everything to the truck, nothing happened, and that option was not there. Once I synced it with the Jeep to the VIN number, I went back in, re-uploaded the TPMS, and then, um, uh, plugged it back in and there's the option there. So that just basically completely disabled my tire pressure monitor system. So that way I don't have to worry about whether or not I set it to a particular value or not. See, you can see the tire pressure is all set to zero.
So there you have it. That's how you disable TPMS for off-road use on the Flash Cow.